It's Opie and Anthony, and you hey. never know who's going to stop on by the NEW studios. we got to say hi to Nick DiPaolo playing Caroline's this weekend. How are you, guys? How are you? Hi, Nick. All right. All right. <laughs> good. Good. Well, okay. guys. This is good. The no. energy. <laughs> the energy. You well, the, the energy is uh, <laughs> frightening in here, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> we have fun in here. So, Come welcome on. to New York. Thanks, thanks for having me. New York City, the city that never sleeps. How come I see people passed out all over the place? <laughs> the city's exhausted as far as I'm concerned. I think Giuliani ought to replace the park benches with futons. You know? <laughs> people sleep anywhere. I don't know how they do it. I got a $2,000 water bed at home. I toss and turn all night. <laughs> These people are like, what's that, a broken Heineken bottle? <laughs> yeah, put a brick on my head. Keep the sun out of my eyes. <laughs> you know, mental illnesses, I lived here for four years. And uh, it's like still out of control. I'm in front of the hotel, this lady comes up and she had more facial hair than I do. She's got one tooth. Right. She's like, why did he leave me? Why did he leave me? <laughs> I don't know. You were hogging the dental floss? I don't know. I'm guessing your husband needed some time to himself. I've known you for two seconds. I could use a vacation. <laughs> I can't get a job. Wash your breasts. <laughs> what a sarcastic <laughs> son of a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> You got some uh, anger in your neck. A little bit. <laughs> a I bit. Uh, you know, I come here. I'm a pacifist in New York. I get yeah, none spitting at me. Get out of the way! I'm trying to get a cab. <laughs> <laughs> Any other observations about New York you'd like to I share just, with everyone? I miss it. Well, I miss it, man. You know, I I I, I don't miss the rent deal. I, when I was here, I was paying you know. You know Fifteen hundred bucks for a one bedroom place is so small you couldn't raise veal in this dump. You know, <laughs> the type of place I'm sitting on the toilet in the bathroom and doing the dishes in the kitchen at the same time. <laughs> Ding dong! Oh, the front door. Yeah, listen. Hey, you're just you're <laughs> describing my place. Cut it out. Yeah, yeah. Is your bathroom like two feet by two feet? But you have that pipe in the middle that heats up to eighty five hundred degrees, so you can smell your own ass flash burning as you're shaving. Somebody's cooking a roast. It's me. <laughs> I, I live, yeah, I, and I, you know, I get in a fight with a guy from a Chinese restaurant in my neighborhood. You know how they stick like a thousand menus under your door every day? Yeah. yeah. People are wondering where the rainforest is going. <laughs> <laughs> every time Hoonan Park changes the price of mushy pork because a family of spotted owls looking for a new home. <laughs> yeah, Giuliani should get rid of those guys and put the menus under your door. Yeah, exactly. You know? He's closing down the strip joints. Yeah. Close down Hoonan Park, young the real fun. I had Chinese food uh, yesterday when I got here. I didn't, I didn't go all the way down to Chinatown. I was kind of lazy, which you should do if you want authentic. Of course. Because this place I went to wasn't authentic. Oh, I, no. I could tell because the waiters, they had the corner of their eyes pulled back with duct tape. <laughs> <laughs> I need a drum uh, for you. <laughs> well, I, was, I can't do long bits, you know. <laughs> The attention span of the average comedy club going you know, <laughs> yeah. reduced to 30 second snippets. <laughs> Very yeah. nice. Anything else on your mind, Nick? <laughs> Had a good flight here. Yeah. Uh, oh. Excellent flight, or actually. Uh, there was a beautiful lady on the flight. I'm not kidding you. She was breastfeeding her baby. Oh. And I'm watching this, paying nothing extra, in coach. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> Every time the kid started crying, she like whipped out her breast. By the end of the flight, I was trying to make the kid cry. <laughs> Twisting his toes, poking the eyes, putting my cigarette on his hand. Come on, kid, you're hungry and I'm horny. Let's work together. Very nice. You want to hang with us? Yeah. All right, yeah. cool. I'll 